It's about 2.11 in the morning. We're getting ready to do our Run Disney Run, but we're planning on being out of here about 2.30 in the morning, so we've got about 20 minutes to get our crap together and get out. I know I didn't sleep any last night. Tia may not have. I think these two were snoring away. I think we're ready to start getting, getting stuff going. I'm going to get my stuff on, ready to go. So, I'm changed. I'm ready to go. I got my wings on. Ooh. Al's ready to go. Nunley and Tia are getting their last minute additions. <laughs> I think they're trying to put their numbers on. It is 2.30 in the morning and we are walking towards uh, that bus right there. Al's ready to go. This is nothing for Al. He's Mr. Spartan Man. He gets up at 2.30 all the time to do these races in the mud. Well, we keep coming upon buses where the uh, bus drivers are sleeping. We're not 100% sure. We're, we're getting to the area where we're supposed to meet, which is over in the uh, Magical Express bus loop, according to the people last night. But I'm sure we're going to run into some folks that are waiting along with us. So we've made it to the, uh, the bus pickup. I think we're the, uh, what, one, two, three, four, like six ones here. All right, we're, we're kind of waiting in the warmth right now in the lobby of the All-Star Music, or, no, we're in All-Star Movies now, All-Star Movies Resort. All by ourselves is this, is this person. He looks like a racer too, he's got his number on. Come with a warning label, or at least an ice pack, okay. Hey. <laughs> okay, we're getting on the bus. It is, I think, right at the time. You guys ready? Yes. All right, cool, 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 cool. All right, and we got a charter bus. Isn't that nice? All right, we made it out. We're on the bus. You guys ready to go? Are you still sleeping? Yeah. Yeah, you had a boat. I don't have the uh, wake up in the morning grogginess because I never went to sleep. Three in the morning, we're on the bus, we're headed to the Magic Kingdom, we're just waiting for the bus to get full. It's almost there, it's almost full. Yes it is. It's our first race ever. H2O. H2O, candy bar, no illusions, this is anything healthy. Nothing to it but to do it. All right, we're officially here. Oh! Woo, it got windy! Yikes! Er, my good. And you got long sleeves at least. Oh, there was no way I was coming out of that room without at least a long sleeve shirt. <laughs> uh -uh, uh -uh. It is a little chilly, but you know what? It's mostly dry. And we got we got the lights greeting us here. Look at this. There's a couple of sheets of light mist blowing at us, but it's not too bad. It's just really, really windy, but not too cold. It's, it's like 60 degrees-ish. So, we've got a dance party going on over here. Get a load of the line behind us. Woo! Everybody say, Burnt Disney! We are officially through bag check. We keep getting a little closer to the, to the dance party. Look at that. What are they doing, Nunley? <laughs> <laughs> She's in a bad mood because it's only 3.30 in the morning, probably. <laughs> yeah, it's still dark, technically. We, not this time of night. We could be, dude, we've been at the park before. We didn't leave until right now. 10.30 is mine and my dog's bedtime. <laughs> That's it. If you're wondering, they do have a line of porta johns that starts there and goes all the way down. I'm be honest, I was actually a little worried about that, but there they are. <laughs> I'm not kidding that it's windy. Get a load of the trash can, it's just blown across the ground. Bless the hearts of the people who are going to have to fix all those because all of the trash cans are on the floor. <laughs> okay, I think we're getting into a photo pass line to take a picture at the starting line. All right, we're getting there. This line's moving. We're not standing still very long. Yeah, it's the throne for the Queen of Hearts. Okay, we're in line for another uh, photo op. Get a load of this. It's the Nautilus. Isn't that cool? And we got characters up on the screen. Um, 
uh, Ursula, which is actually way over there. Oh, it was so warm next to that thing, the, the heat blowing out of the engine. So while we've been standing in this line to take a picture with the Nautilus, I noticed what that was. Get a load of this. This is actually the old ride vehicle for the 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea ride at the Magic Kingdom back in the day. That is awesome. It is 4.20 in the morning and the crowd is getting big. <laughs> but we're in corral number four, the bar. Well, it says four on it, so. And we're just waiting. Tip. Brandon's been sitting in a porta potty all morning. You darn tootin' I had, because it's warm in there, and they are clean and brand spanking new. And there is no one in those lines. Look at that. There is nobody in the Porta John line, so you can sit in there, stay warm, it gets cold, go back over there. I sat in there for about probably five minutes, warmed up, came back out here, and I'm like, I'm good to go again for another 20 minutes. That's good run Disney tips right there. No, it's not. It is. No, it's not. <laughs> it would be a problem if there were people waiting, but there's nobody in line. There's literally nobody over there waiting to get those porta jars. You don't find it weird at all that you're sitting in a porta potty? I guarantee there's a lot of other people that do it too. Maybe not at this race, but at races.